crafty friends. This is Teresa with Fresh and Renewed with Teresa, and I am back today with a fantastic haul, and I'm very excited about this. I have got the Seaside Summer Collection from Doodlebug Designs. Now, most of it is available in Jamie's shop, what isn't available in Jamie's shop, I will link down below to other sources. So, I got the odds and ends, and there are 116 pieces. I'm very excited to use some of these pieces on my cards. I'm very excited. And then there's the chit chat, which I'm used to using. Um, lots of sentiments and little tags, which you can turn into sentiments if you want to without them having a little tag part on them. Um, some bigger pieces for um, slimline cards or for, um, or even for scrapbook pages. And then a new to me, um, they've been doing these for a little while, but a new to me, um, piece is this is called bits and pieces and you have some palm trees and some flowers and leaves and then you have some like um like little elements that you can put your image on some tags some um circles and other shapes and stuff so you have that i'll get to this paper pad in just a second I have um, both stamp sets that came with this collection. I have the Doodle Stamp Seaside Summer. It has a palm tree, a sailboat, a little speedboat, and a lighthouse, and then um, some um, beach huts, and then um, some other little ele elements. The sentiments on it are, I love you a yacht, Hope your day is smooth sailing. Let's sail, sail a break. Have a sensational birthday. It's a buoy. And happy Father's Day. Then the next sentiment is called Sea Life, or the next uh, stamp set is called Sea Life. Oh, and I did get the coordinating dies to go with them as well. The next stamp set is called Sea Life, and you have an octopus, a fish, a crab, a shark, a dolphin, a turtle, uh, another fish, a jellyfish, a starfish, and some shells and some bubbles. And then you have these sentiments. Have a jawsome birthday. Have a fantastic birthday, or have a fantastic day, I'm sorry. Best fishes with oceans and oceans of love and totally awesome. And again, I got the coordinating dies. And there is a die in here that there's not a stamp for. That's kind of silly. It's just, uh, maybe there's not supposed to be a stamp for it but it's look like a piece of coral. So, okay. Then I also got a couple sheets of the icons. Um, they have the beach houses and the palm tree and critters all over. And then I got the 12 by 12 collection pack. So you'll be seeing me use this um, very soon. And you'll be seeing me use this, this one very soon, the six by six paper pad. I have a very, very special video coming up on Sunday. I'm gonna be using this, this um, collection like really soon. I have a special video coming up on Sunday um, with the six by six paper pad. And then I have a special video coming up next week with the 12 by 12 paper. 
So let's look through the six by six paper pad really quick. We have the, um, like the pattern piece. And then we have some um, coral um, seashells. And then we have a wavy pattern that's teal. Then this is a beach sand color with some crabs and seagulls on it. Then we have some floral paper, some leaf paper, flamingos, some more floral paper that's smaller, some plaid, some sunshines, some palm trees. Then we have, I'm gonna turn this, this around. Then we have some cut apart that over here, Doodlebug did away with this sheet for a long time, brought it back with the sentiments over here. And I love these sentiments. Let's take a quick look at them. Life is happy on the water. One big happy family. Happy birthday. Life is best on the beach. This is paradise, thinking of you. Then we have thinking of you again, our summer vacation, fun at the beach, living the life, have a beautiful day. You're so sweet. Thank you. Sunshine and happiness just for you. And this is paradise again. So that's going to be fun to use. Then we have a polka dot piece of paper and some borders. Then we have some sea life and some words. I always love these text papers. And then a fun stripe, some sailboats, some hibiscus, and on the back of the hibiscus are some little cut aparts. And then we have a little scene on the beach some stripes, some seashells, and those tags. I don't ever use those. Well, they're not tags. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say tags. They're like journal, little journaling things. I don't ever use those in the six by six. So, alrighty. So we have all that. And, I have to grab this because it fell down while I was getting everything together. And we have what I purchased for um, doodle box, doodle pots, and enamel dots. I love doodle pops. Okay, so we have some sea critters. This one is called Shore is Fun. We have a jellyfish, a turtle, a crab, a, no, that's not a jellyfish. That is a squid, a turtle, a crab, and a jellyfish. So I bought two of those. I have two shaker pops that are the um, the little beach in a bottle is what that one's called. Those are those are cute and going to be really fun. And then we have celebrate good times. So we have a sailboat. We have. the toucan and some flowers, and it's toucan tango. Then we have the, um, what's that called? A sand castle. It's called Sandastic, and a beach pail and a um, shovel. Then we have the shaker pot that is, it says, Fresh gelato ice cream. So you have some ice cream theme and it's called gelato flavors. And then we got two of these and they are little drinks and it's called fruit cocktail. So that one is cute, cute, cute. I can't wait to use that one. And then we have some fishies and it's called tropical fish. 
Then for Doodle Pops, I got the regular um, enamel dot summer sprinkles. And I am nef definitely need to use these up making my cards. And then I got two of the shape sprinkles. I got the Seaside Summer and then Down by the Sea. I love these little bubbles. Ooh, it's got lots of little bubbles here. And then lots of shapes over there. Um, what I have found, I am very particular about buying uh, shape sprinkles because I find them hard to use on cards. I started using them on the inside to kind of, um, you know, dress up the little strip that I put on the inside. However, um, from my experience, if you don't use your um, sh shape sprinkles, now not necessarily the enamel dots, but the shape sprinkles, if you don't use them after some time, they turn yellow. So I am very particular about what I use and I try to use them when I'm using that collection now, once I discovered that. So anyhow, that, that is all my, my goodies and I hope you will stay tuned and watch and everything will be linked down below, um, either to Not Too Shabby Shop or in, um, to somewhere else that has um, that product. So thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.